Hello and welcome to Skamashi TV Tech, where we review everything and anything in short, concise videos. In this episode, we have a one hand mixer with one mixer, so it's not a double mixer, it's just a one hand mixer for small things you want to mix. And it is battery powered, so it can be brought everywhere and is portable. So let's have a quick look at this one hand mixer. It is USB rechargeable, so that means you have no cord, you, it is battery powered and can be also used portable so you can bring it with you and as you can see from the small box it is very small. On the back side we don't have much, just a short explanation, high speed, low speed, medium, on off and the charging indicator and that it is available in various colors, in pink, white and black. The price of this product is 23 British pounds, currently on Amazon at the time of the review. When we open the box, we find a little hand mixer multi-language user manual in color and on a very good quality paper. We find the accessories. We have one here, two. We have the USB charging cable, which is uh, very short, I would say. And we have the hand mixer itself, which is very small and has here a little button and as you can see it is charged, it is working. Charging plug unfortunately is micro USB, not USB-C. Uh, in 2021, in my personal opinion, everything should be USB-C, there should be no micro USB anymore on new devices. Okay, so we have now this little handy mixer here, battery powered, which means you can bring it anywhere. We have the USB charging cable, uh, you can charge it via USB on any USB connector but they do not supply a power plug. That means you need to connect it either to an existing USB outlet or to one of your chargers directly with this. So there's no wall plug, power plug uh, supplied with this. Then we have the mixing accessories. We can just put it in like in any normal, normal mix as well and then we should be good to go and can turn it on. So as we have seen, you always turn it on and off to increase the speed. So you cannot switch directly through the speeds, you always need to turn it on. Low speed, turn it off. Turn it on again. Medium speed, turn it off again. And turn it on again and then we have high speed. To remove it, just pull it out like you would do with any hand mixer. Plug it in again and the same with the other one. Okay, let's remove that. On the bottom, we can see it has a CE sign and FC, so all the, the necessary uh, signs are to be allowed to sell it in Europe uh, on the device. So that should give you a fairly reassurance that it's not uh, exploding in your, in your face. Uh, it is battery powered. I tried uh, it fully charged. It takes about an hour, one and a half until it's fully charged. I think if you need a portable mixer for any purpose or whatever for 23 pounds this is a good device the quality it's uh, it feels a rubberized quality feels very good uh, feels quality except the switch the switch feels very cheap plastic uh, it feels like a very cheap plastic it's very sensitive as soon as you touch it a bit it already uh, will start but the device itself the casing is uh, rubberized and feels very very good and very uh, very sturdy, so I don't think there will be uh, any direct quality issues. Uh, and I think for camping, it definitely might be a good item for 24, 23 pounds.